Good morning guys, welcome to this video. Today is a full day of eating for you guys. It's going to be a little bit different. You guys can probably already tell from the title. I've done one of these videos before and it actually did really, really well on my channel. I think it's like the third most viewed video, third or fourth most viewed video. It has like 60,000 views right now, I think. And it is full day of eating with my girlfriend, Courtney, back here, volume two. So, we didn't really plan this out much. I the more I think about it, like when I woke up this morning, I was like, shit, we probably should have went to the store and actually got some ingredients for breakfast, but that wasn't the case. We're just going to go into the kitchen right now. I don't know if she's going to eat breakfast. I don't know. We're going to do this totally separately. So if she wants to eat breakfast, uh, I'll obviously get it on film for you guys, but I'm going to go in there right now, uh, scavenge through the cabinet, scavenge through the fridge and see what we got to work with for breakfast. I know we don't have a lot because I haven't gone to the store in a while, but my macros for today are going to be listed on the screen right over here for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. We're going to jump right into meal number one starting right now. First things first, in the morning, first thing you gotta do is make yourself a cup of coffee. We got the Mick Cafe Winter Wonder Keurig. Now, the most important thing, finding a meal that you will enjoy. So here's what we have to work with. Here's my part of the cabinet or cupboards. I got croutons, rice, almonds, peanut butter, bread, and more bread. So not a lot of things to work with here. And in the fridge, let's see what we got. We got a little bit more in here. This is kind of my area. We got mushrooms, little kebab things, asparagus, chicken, turkey, a protein shake that I totally forgot to drink last night, eggs, and then egg whites right here that are pretty much gone. And we got oats and my protein powders right here. So what I think I'm gonna do Meal number one is gonna be a fairly light meal. We're gonna do some toast. This is uh, Dave's Killer Bread Organic Power, Organic Bread Power Seed. The macros are actually pretty good on here. Two grams of fat, 17 carbs, and five grams of protein per slice. So we're obviously gonna do two of those. We're gonna do a little, I think we're gonna do a breakfast sandwich uh, with eggs, egg whites, and I think I'm going to throw a little bit of ground turkey and onions in there. So we'll see what I end up doing. We're working with half a serving of 93.7 ground turkey, a handful of onions right here, three eggs, and then exactly, it was like two servings of egg whites right here, 10 grams of protein. So we're gonna let this cook up a little bit, throw the eggs in, throw the onions in, toast the toast, and voila, we're gonna have a breakfast sandwich. Okay, so Courtney's making meal number one right now. My meal's already pretty much done. I'm just gonna plate it in a little bit. What are you doing? I'm uh, making a breakfast burrito. You have to be a little louder than that. I'm making a breakfast burrito. She's making a breakfast burrito mm -hmm. with hashies. A serving of hash browns, and then I'm going to do two eggs, and then just a little tiny bit of cheese, and one of the tortillas. So two eggs, a serving of this. A little bit of medium cheddar cheese and then one super soft mission tortilla. She never tracks her calories like ever, so I'll just, just for the sake of the video, I'm gonna track everything she eats. Should I not track it? No, you can, but I don't know. It's scary. Um, I'll track, I actually wanna track her macros just today, so I'm gonna track everything that she eats as well as obviously what I eat right now. I just had to re-download my fitness pal because my phone broke, I don't know if I mentioned that, but I smashed the screen so my whole phone had a factory reset on it, so I had to download all my apps, um, so I'm just now getting the My Fitness Pal, which is why I haven't eaten anything yet because I wanna make sure I track everything before I eat it. 
So she also did like I don't know maybe a serving of this. I don't in even a, think I did a serving. In her coffee, maybe a half a serving of this in her coffee. Her coffee, my coffee, my toast. All right. So as you guys can tell, I added two extra waffles just because my carbs, I think, were at like, yeah, they're at like 34 grams, which is really low for a meal uh, for me personally. So this is meal number one. Eggs, egg whites, ground turkey, onions, ketchup, which I'd never track, two slices of bread, two whole grain waffles, and then a cup of coffee right here. So my macros, as of right now, are pretty, pretty low but I do have a photo shoot later today, so this is probably gonna be the only meal that I eat before then. Uh, I don't really wanna have a full stomach when I go and shoot, so I'm gonna have a smaller meal right now, maybe a potential snack before I go, it's at two o'clock, and then the rest of my calories I'm gonna hit after this photo shoot, so I'm definitely gonna have some big meals later tonight. Uh, my running total, it's 54 grams of protein, 59 grams of carbs, and then 26 grams of fat right here. And then, Courtney, has her breakfast burrito right here. Are you putting anything on it? Like ketchup? Absolutely not. So this is it, she hates ketchup on eggs. So does Megan. Uh, 47 grams of carbs, 12 grams of fat, and 17 grams of protein. That is the meal, guys. Let me give you guys my calories real quick. Oh, yeah. Not that it really matters. Yeah, um, 665 calories is this meal right here. Not a 365. And then hers is 365 calories. I'll check in with you guys probably in a few hours when my next meal is. Like I said, I have that photo shoot, so I might, might eat before. If not, I'll eat after. Hey, Siri. Can you find me a Chipotle nearby? One option I found is Chipotle Mexican Grill, which averages two and a half stars and is moderately priced. Does that one sound good? Yes. It's been way too long since I've had Chipotle. Hi, can I get a chicken bowl with double white rice and then double black double beans? White rice, brown beans, pinto beans, and chicken. Is that it? It's been way too long. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Thank you. Can I get guac too? Yeah, that'll be it. Thank you so much. Okay, current time is, first let me get some light in here for you guys so you can see me. Current time is 4.52 in the evening right now. The reason, another reason why I got Chipotle besides me not having it for a really long time is just because it was convenient. I'm actually meeting uh, the homies at the gym in about 30 minutes and there's no way um, I was gonna be able to drive home and then cook something up, eat it, and then go to the gym and meet them on time. So I was just like, screw it, I'm gonna go grab some Chipotle. I'm craving it right now. So that's what I did and I just added up the macros and this Chipotle bowl is 1,120 calories. 58 grams of protein, 40 grams of fat, which is kind of scaring me a little bit. I've never really had a meal that high in a very, very long time. And then 132 grams of protein. Ooh, it's heavy. I've never had guacamole on my bowl before, but I was watching Max Tuning's full day of eating video earlier this morning when he was trying to make guacamole and it just made me really like want it. So this is gonna be a little taste test of guacamole. Here we go. Let me do this. I can definitely see why there's 22 grams of fat. But, it's not bad. Guacamole on my burrito bowl is not bad at all. Probably won't get it again just because of that number right there. And now I only have like 20 grams of fat left in the day. But uh, this is it guys. 1,120 calories. A nice little pre-workout meal, high in carbs, high in everything really. So I'm gonna go to the gym right now after I eat this. I'm gonna hit a pole day with the boys and then afterwards I think Courtney and I are gonna go grab something to eat as well. She ended up getting a smoothie. I think the clip most likely is probably already in the video. I told her if she ever gets, if she gets something without me to just film it on her camera. So that's what she did. It's about four o'clock and Nick is still shooting or on his way back from our shoot, or our shoot, his shoot. Uh, but Megan and I are running around in Los Feliz and we stopped at this juice place and they actually had their macros online which is why I chose to go there. 
So I got this protein smoothie. It has like plant-based protein, banana, blueberries, and almond milk in it. So the macros are 21 grams of carbs, five grams of fat, and 13 grams of protein. So that brings my daily total now to 68 grams of carbs, 17 grams of fat, and 30 grams of protein. So I think Nick and I are probably gonna go eat later tonight or maybe like right before he goes to the gym. We'll see uh, when we both get back to the apartment, but we're going to enjoy this. Megan's having an acai bowl and we're gonna go paint some pottery. So we'll see you guys later. So we'll see how the footage is, but uh, she got a smoothie for her lunch and then later tonight we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do. So peace out guys. I'll see you in a little bit. Yeah, Eki's right behind me. He's gonna park. Actually, just park in my spot. Down in the garage. Yeah. <laughs> Here, go in front of me and I'll open it. Can you hold this real quick? It's um, 8.05 in the evening right now. I just picked up Courtney. Uh, Eki's going to my parking spot right now to park in the garage, and then we're all gonna go to Chick fil A and uh, grab post workout meal, or at least Eki and I post workout meal, and then Courtney's gonna grab. Oh, you worked out too? Yeah. Oh, Courtney worked out at the uh, apartment gym as well, so we're all getting post-workout meals right now. All right, we got the crew. We're going in the Chick-fil-A right now. I already know what I'm getting. I calculated and everything to make sure it fit in my macros because I literally only have about like 15 grams of fat left after that huge Chipotle bowl. Yeah, right, you're just getting sandwiches? Yeah. The sandwiches. The one I, it's a driver's license. Hi, can I get two my grilled chicken sandwiches as well? No, I'm not. Do you have ketchup? Yeah, I'll just do that. <laughs> Chicken sandwich? Yeah, two grilled chicken sandwiches. I really wanted the fries, but I can't do it. Cold nuggets. Nuggets? And that's it? Oh, nice. Regular ones, right? Yeah, the, the grilled ones taste like wet napkins. Saw me my first time. Like, I was like, oh, oh wow. Oh, thank you. All right. Oh, big guy. The goods. Two of them. Uh, this is post workout meal right here. <laughs> we are at Ralph's right now. We're gonna pick up pick up the food that I need for later tonight. Uh, I'm gonna make a smoothie and then kebabs. Kebabs. Can I go wrong with that? Exactly. Look at Eki. Eki's a pro camera guy. Like five dollars. Like a this. Day. <laughs> Eki, please, God, do it. I don't want to do it anymore. Look at him. He's, he's got he's got the of torture. Ooh, varsity. All right. Team player. You know it's all right. Now Rob be the man wanna see you doing good. I don't wanna get rich, leave you in the hood. Girl in my eyes, you the bad. It's the reason why I love you. You don't like me cause that. See you live at our bridge. I'll be a friend. Let's get her moving. Let's get her back on shore. I wish they had smell vision so you could smell how bad it smells. Yeah, I, bur I just the burnt worst. the crap out of my clutch accidentally. I had it in third and I thought it was in first. It literally smells like a burnt animal. Like a burnt hair <laughs> mixed with a burnt ass. <laughs> mixed with t like tar. Why did I turn off my car? I don't know. Here you go. Because you want you want to hear Eki's badass speaker really like, like, vibrate. Like, like it, it, now it's like... <laughs> <laughs> like when you hear the beats and the bass. <laughs> <laughs> Eki was talking about how he blew out his speakers and how every time he turns on music really loud it sounds horrible. So he's gonna test it out right now. Play us a banger. I don't know where she's going. I think he's... <laughs> 
Do you have syrup? <laughs> it, it sounds like a baby bird chirping. Alright, I'll see you tomorrow. All right. <laughs> see you later. Um, I'm gonna make a smoothie and then we can watch it. So, just got home from the store, I took a shower, and I'm gonna make a, myself a quick smoothie just because I have quite a bit of calories left over, and then we're gonna watch Stranger Things 2. Megan, Courtney, and I are all gonna watch it. So I'm gonna whip this out or knock this out really quickly. I got a banana at the store, which I started freezing. So I'm gonna do one whole banana. This is Courtney's. Um, probably, probably half a package of this. We're gonna do... You think cake batter or uh, chocolate will taste better in a smoothie? Mm -hmm. Ready to get a smoothie? Banana, strawberry, and then protein powder and almond milk. Uh, chocolate. Yeah. chocolate. So we're going to do a, a scoop of Optum Nutrition Whey Protein with that. And then we're going to add the liquid, which is going to be some almond milk right here. So very simple smoothie, four ingredients. Let's do it. Cows? Mm -hmm. Nice. So you hold this. Okay. So we're about to end this video. I'm gonna have Courtney finish her segment. Oh, you're gonna say finish my so ice cream. You, so what'd you do? Wait, let me sit up. Um, so after I got back from Chick fil A, I had a serving of. Hold it. This chocolate. Trader Joe's um, coconut ice cream. Okay, so we ended the day at uh, 1,172 um, calories total, and that is 110 grams of carbs, 46 grams of fat, and 74 grams of protein. So, you guys know I never shy away from massive meals before bed. Is this lighting gonna? Yeah, that's pretty bad. Better? Yeah. So you guys know I never shy away from massive meals before bed. It's currently 12.10 in the evening right now. I'm going to eat this, watch some YouTube videos, and then probably uh, go to bed within the next 30 minutes here. And I think this meal, I don't know, actually, I don't even know how many calories it is. I just aim for the macros. But we have a serving or two servings of Brussels sprouts here. I bought these at the store. Eki, I don't know, Eki told me to get them, and I was kind of craving them after he told me that. <laughs> And then I ended up getting these kebab things yesterday and I just added four ounces of chicken in them. So you guys can see the chicken right here. I did four ounces just to hit my proteins. Uh, hit my protein spot on. I think at 225 grams of protein in total. I would show you guys my macros, but my phone's dead. So you're just gonna have to trust me, I hit my macros. <laughs> and then I was really, really low on carbs. Like we're talking over 100 grams of carbs low. Uh, so I ended up doing a massive, I, I went to Ralph's and picked out the biggest potato they had and luckily it was the exact amount of carbs I needed. So I cut these into little uh, chip shapes and baked them up. This is one of my favorite carb sources ever. And then I'm having 
Uh, I always do Pellegrinos before I go to bed or after the gym, and I did like 10, 10 dashes of bitters in here as well. And I did, I've had this Halo Top. You guys, a lot of you guys know Halo Top came out with seven new flavors like, I think like three months ago. And I bought this a while ago, but you guys know I do really, really bad and my skin does really bad with dairy. So I haven't had dairy. Oh, you haven't tasted this yet? Since I bought this. I haven't opened it. It's been sitting oh. in the fridge for like two months. I'm going to have a little bit of it. I'm, I'm dairy free now. A lot of you guys already know that except for like um, my whey protein. So I'm going to have a little scoop of this just to give you guys my thoughts on the Halo Top candy bar flavors. Man, I wish I wouldn't have brushed my teeth. I wouldn't have tried it. <laughs> oh my god, fail. What kind of candy bar is it supposed to be? I don't know. It's like Heath? It doesn't taste like a candy bar. It's really sweet. It almost has like a coffee hint to it. I think it's supposed to be Heath. Looks like it's it. It's good. <laughs> um, Wait, yeah. Can I see the back of it's it? It's not really a whole lot to it. And just, there's like some nuts in there. Um, but that's going to wrap up this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Drop a like if you did enjoy this video. It would be awesome if we can get this video. I'm going to go big here. If we can get this video to a thousand likes, that would make my day. Peace out, guys. We will see you soon. <laughs> and, um, yeah, have a great rest of your day. Can I have a potato? No. <laughs>